Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we'll be making this crumble layered apple cake. First you'll need to peel and grate six eating apples. Add in a squeeze of lemon. And two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Now for a teaspoon of ginger, a teaspoon of cinnamon, and a teaspoon of nutmeg. And I'm gonna put half a teaspoon of allspice. And give it a good mix through. And to the apples, I'm just gonna add two tablespoons of soft brown sugar. Give it a good mix through and leave it to the side. Here I have 210 grams of plain flour, 160 grams of jumbo oats and a pinch of salt. Now I'm adding 85 grams of soft brown sugar. Now I have 150 grams of very cold butter. And I'm just literally pinching the butter into the flour and oats until it resembles breadcrumbs. There we go, butter's all worked in now. I'm adding three tablespoons of desiccated coconut to the apple mixture. I have heavily greased my baking tin and I've preheated the oven to 180. And now I'm layering the oaty mixture on the bottom and I'm going to put it in tight and compact. I'm not going to leave it loose. I'm going to be pressing that down. Now I'm adding about half of the apple mixture and again I'm going to tightly pack that down as well. And on top of that goes more of the oaty mixture. And again, I tightly press that down, getting into all the sides and the middle.
and now goes the last of the apple mixture. Topped off with tightly packed crumble mixture. Now I'm just sprinkling some brown sugar on top. Now it's ready to bake for about 30 to 40 minutes. And there it is, the crumble layered apple cake after 35 minutes of baking. And I'm just gonna leave that in the tin to cool for about 10 minutes. Well, this is crunchy, it's moist inside with all the apple and kind of caramelizing around the sides. Really beautiful. I hope you get to give this a try. Of course, you could serve this with cream, custard, ice cream, and of course, on its own. I hope you've enjoyed today's recipe, crumble layered apple cake. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.